yan ay naturo ko sa inyo. So, bones are categorized into many uh, classification. But let's divide the bones or human skeletal system into two. What are those? Axial and appendicular. Again, axial and appendicular. Meaning, for those who are not least, uh, located in the midline, they are appendicular. And for those who are located, bones located in the midline are axial. So, ano yun? Pwede kung social ka, hindi eh, yung sabi mo, axial. Alright? So, bahala ka na kung anong ano mo ba ang uh, pronunciation mo. Alright, so your skull, matakot ka kung appendicular ang skull mo. Ha? Ano yung nakahawakan mo yung skull, no? Nalilipat-lipat mo. Alright? So next, your vertebra. Alright? Your backbone. And then your ribs. And your sternum. Your collarbones. Alright? Okay, ano pa? Ang hindi mo kayang i-appendicular, yung pelvis mo. Alright? Okay? So, madaling makita kung babae o lalaki ang isang bungo, isang buong uh, katawan ng tao, yung buto na lang, kung babae o lalaki. Ano ang mas malaki? Ang circle. Sa lalaki, circle. Sa babae, oblong. Ha? Pelvis. Ha? Alright? Okay, kaya nalalaman kapag uh, there is a massacre, then madami na nangyari uh, how many years later, alright? And then they will check, alright, this is female because of the pelvis. Uh, so, kung magiging massacre, ano ka? Dugin mo na yung pelvis para hindi makita <laughs> ng, alright, ng mga forensic. No, ay matigas siya, paano mo yun, ano yun. Alright, so next, we have, oh, nasa ng femur? Femur, the longest, what? Longest bone and we have our humerus. So, napaka-importante nito. Alright? Again, what is the function of a nursing assistant? I told you to increase activity daily living. Tulit-tulit yan. Again, increase activity of daily living. If there is problem between the femur and humerus, what will happen? The patient cannot hold some coffee. Alright? Patient cannot walk. Right. You advise the patient with diabetes to what? To run, to do some walking. I may mean, femur fracture. Paano? Right? That's why next classes we will uh, you should be excited that you will be learning some assistive devices. So ano daw yung mga assistive devices? Right? Canes, diba? crutches, so kung paano mag-move. Hindi pwedeng hula-hula lang yun, ha? So, meron yung paraan, di ba? So, meron swing. Yan, ano dyan? Sabay yung ano, may swing. May mga ganun. Alright? So, depende kung alin yung may mahina sa pasyente. Okay. Next, we have number 7. Alright? So, what is this? So, wide example of carpals and tarsals are two. Yes. Okay? Again, where are your tarsals? On your foot or on your feet. So, where are your carpals? In your hands. Okay? Next week, get ready, ha? Mayroon tayo. Oh, ang daming absent next week. Kasi may ano. Alright? Okay? Alright. Number eight. We have, oh, I told you before. A while ago. The classification of human bone uh, skeletal uh, system is what? Axial and appendicular. Correct. Okay. So, number nine. Okay. Branch. Meaning, you are looking for the branch of medicine. And what is this? Orthopedics. So, what do you mean by orthotics? These are the, what? The doctors. Alright? Under the uh, orthopedic surgery. Alright? Next, we have podiatry. What is that? Uh, doctors who are specializing to remove or to treat the uh, fingernails, foot, or finger, or the phalanges in the foot. Dito po, ay, sa salon lang yan. Ano? Hindi, iba pa yun, may gamot. For diabetic patient, di ba? Healing in the foot, right? Okay. 